Hello, my name is Crystal Chibu. I'm your home catalyst. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you how to say no without feeling guilty. What's really I call the breaking the good person syndrome or the good person people syndrome, whatever it is. If you're yet to subscribe to this channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button and also turn on the notification button. That way you would not miss anything at all. So today, I'm sharing how to say no without feeling guilty. Pretty much a lot of times when we have to say no to people, what happens is you start feeling bad, as if you have even done something wrong, even when you've actually not done anything wrong. And the right thing in that circumstance is to say no. And this is because when you think about it, saying no comes with a feeling of not knowing how the other person will react or how the person will take what you're saying no to and because of that you just um, start feeling guilty or start um, you're, you're not even sure if the person is going to resent you so I think that's one of the reasons people they definitely do not want to say no when sh they should say no in a circumstance as much as yes we want to give everything and say yes to everything uh, because uh, there are people that you know just say yes even without thinking about it it's important for you to be aware and know um, and say no really when you should say no and not feel really bad about it. We all want to be good people and so I know it's sometimes difficult and this is one of the things that I've battled with and so that's why I'm going to be sharing uh, a few things uh, that have helped me in order for me to say no. The first one is knowing and setting boundaries. I think that a lot of times uh, because we don't set boundaries and because people um, don't know when to stop and as a result of that it keeps affecting us we just literally um, say yes because um, is it okay if I call you by 10 p.m. and really you know that by 10 p.m. you're going to be in another meeting um, you, you just say oh yeah it's okay but it's really not okay and or by 10 p.m. is when you go to bed or 10 p.m. is when you sleep it's not okay really but you just say oh, you know you, uh, yes yes you, you you can and what then happens is at the end of the day you start feeling bad or it starts affecting you one way or the other so the first thing that you need to do is set your boundaries know what your boundaries are understand pretty much uh, what it is that you can allow what it is that you will not allow and um, that should help you um, in order for you to say no when it is not in line with your values with your boundaries whatever it is that no then becomes very easy to say the second thing that i think uh, has really worked for me is being aware of yourself so my persona is such that you know i don't want to hurt anybody i don't want someone feeling bad and i i, I know that this is just me and that's why a lot of times i say yes to things so pretty much you want to be aware of your person so you know uh, when you're just saying no necessarily you you know if, if you're a bad person and you know that you just want to say no and um if you are um a good person as it were and you already are aware of yourself and you know that it's because it's going to inconvenience you in a way that you cannot accommodate then when you say no it's easier for you because you are already aware of that person that you are and the final one is just say no um, like I tell my kids open your mouth and say it no um, and, and, and that's what it sometimes just takes for us to be able to move on that's what it takes for us to be able to try that's what it takes for us to actually not feel guilty the fact that I said no in that circumstance um, when I needed to say no I know it can be sometimes tough for some people to just let it out so maybe you need to practice and just say no 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 and get to the point where you just say but it's as easy as as it is just say no and um, I think that that way you do well finally be assertive and be courageous when you've made up your mind about something and it's not in line again I say with your values with your boundaries with your timings or whatever it is all you just need to do is say um, no and if you are assertive you definitely should not feel guilty about it i've shared just four but i know there are a lot of ways to say no without being 
guilty um so what do you need to do drop me a comment in the box and let's have a chat about it and let me know what your opinion is and what you think about saying no and maybe share your experience on how uh wanting to say no and how it's been a bit tough and how you've dealt with it have a lovely day Thank you.